So let's start with your proposal to create a presidential crime commission. Why don't you explain what that is and what the goal is, especially with President Trump? The idea is that, you know, we're going to have to have a, you know, a reckoning over what the president uh, and his enablers have done uh, to our country. And I want that to be independent. I want it to be outside of Congress. But I, I do believe that uh, we need to understand uh, just, you know, what crimes uh, were committed and, you know, how do we, you know, have a, a truth and reconciliation process in this country so that no uh, president, no senior leader, no cabinet official is able to get away uh, again with what we think Donald Trump has gotten away with. What exactly is the crime? Like, what crime would it be that he's committed at this point? And, and I feel like if he's just going to go away, if you now go after him for this crime, that's just going to extend the amount of time that we're talking about him and that he is also going to have an opportunity to, to have a platform to talk about his uh, view of the election. My proposal is to actually look at what he's done during the four years, whether it's with, you know, the emoluments clause, uh, the pressure he's put on the Southern District of New York, you know, using Bill Barr, uh, sabotaging the mail, uh, especially as it relates to mail-in ballots. Uh, but as it relates to transition, yes, uh, he's jeopardizing our national security every day that Joe Biden is not able to put together a national security team, receive a briefing, or have his potential nominees uh, vetted. I mean, that's going to make us uh, less safe. Uh, but I think the worst thing we can do is to make Donald Trump more significant than he really is uh, right now. Uh, he's locked up. We haven't heard from him. We haven't seen him. Uh, he needs to you know, come to terms with this and, and be an adult. Uh, but Joe Biden's going to be the president, and the American people should have confidence that that's going to be the case.